Hi, my name is Jason McBano. I've been a wedding videographer for 18 years now and I'd like to share with you some of the equipment that we use for shooting weddings. I'm super big with audio equipment. Why do I like to get great audio? Because for me, that drives a story. It just makes the film come alive. It makes it so much more real than just slapping on video onto music. So that for me is very, very important. Let's get it on. You see, a proper unboxer would have a box cut. This is how a new Instamic looks like. And I was told to do this. But we're on manual focus, so it's pretty useless. So we have mounting options, I believe, under Quick Start Guide. Real premium feel. I like great packaging. Micro USB cable. This is finicky with the cables that you use with it. So. Uh, make sure that you keep this. The China cables that you probably have for your tablet or your phone may not work with the Instamic. You have three mounting options that you put behind the Instamic, like that. You have a magnet, you have Velcro, and you have just regular double-sided tape. I wouldn't say that the mounting options are super secure. It, it, it just slips on. You gotta be careful when using these in extreme conditions. Looking closely here, okay, you have the logo of the Instamic. This acts as a power button. It has three LED lights which really serve not much purpose, I'm afraid. I'm gonna press it right now. It's just a series of LEDs blinking. And I have to trust the device that it is recording right now. So one of the major complaints I have really is that you are operating this blind if you're not using a mobile phone. I would have loved for a red LED or even an orange if the battery is low, but there's none. Lights are off, but it's recording. It can be tricky. It can be tricky. So. Unless you want to screw up your project or your big interview with a CEO or a celebrity and you get one chance, you have to use the app. This is the app. So these are the list of the devices that I have paired with my phone. Now take note, it has to be iOS 11. Anything older than iOS 11 will not okay, be detected by the Instamic. So it's, you know, take note that there's a big record button right there. There's a counter, there's a time counter over there. And this is an audio meter to see the levels. I also have the ability to just use the gain, lower it down, or increase it. There. Okay, so let's put it back where it was before. So this is the app, also available in Android. One minor gripe about the app, it's slow. You would have to wait maybe two to four seconds before it actually starts recording. The same goes when stopping recording. Take note again. All the recording happens in this device, the Instamic. Nothing gets recorded in your phone. This is just a remote control for the Instamic. It's eight gigabytes. It's gonna take forever before it fills up. Battery time, according to specs on the website, is three hours. I guess that's with continuous use, but I never had a problem with battery. I've never had a problem with it dying down on me. Battery life is Great. One of the very first things that we did after opening the Instamic was update the firmware. So that's one thing I love about the company is that I know that more features will be added. What am I looking for? Maybe a faster app, uh, more settings on the app so I can control uh, the sound recording better. One of the things that I'd like you to take notice of is that array of microphones right here on the top. That alone, I guess, makes it worth the sticker price because you're not just getting one capsule microphone on a lavalier but you get four it's an array of microphones so pickup is super super nice according to the website this is waterproof the other version is splash proof but it's rubberized i'm pretty confident that this can withstand splashing in the water maybe not a dip into the pool i wouldn't risk that but uh, at least wet clothes uh, i think it can withstand that it's tiny it's super super tiny this is the size of an iphone 10 and this is the size of an instamic how do i mount it how do i mount it to the person wearing it my favorite way of mounting it is to use the magnets right over here so there's a magnet attachment and the actual instamic is under my clothes. It's simple, it's elegant, it's convenient, and uh, it's just super, super quick. I'm, I'm done five seconds flat. Put it inside the clothing, clip on the magnet, it snaps, and I'm good to go. Now, you may complain that it, you know, it just, you know, it looks lousy, right? Yeah, I didn't put much thought on the microphone place placement uh, for, uh, for today. 
And I must admit that I just really want to show you. You know, I want to show you the magnet. Future solutions that I could see. Paint the magnet white for white clothing. Maybe just use liquid paper and paint it matte black for my other, uh, for my black uh, Instamic. So it blends in better so it doesn't shine like this. Another solution actually, I got some microphone clips from Lazada and these are just 300 pesos. Break this off, the one that goes into the lavalier microphone, just sandpaper this real smooth and then bond it with one of the extra clips that Instamic provides. So I'll have a mounting option very, very close to that of a regular lavalier microphone. We've gone through the unboxing, we've gone through the accessories that come with it. The single most important thing that you need to know is how does it sound like, right? And my verdict for this, I would say eight and a half out of 10. During vows, clipped onto a microphone of a priest, on the shirt pocket of a groom, or even just under the gown of a bride, and I get great results all the time. And I'd like to share to you some samples. Me, every time I look at it, it's, it gives me so much strength. It's like, it's the hardest thing you had to do in your life. And one year later, we get married. We've been doing it pretty well. We did pretty well. Those you love, those who brought you life shall be my people from this day on. Your close friends who helped shape you into the wonderful person you have become. <laughs> Mahal, good afternoon. Finally, June 23, 2018 has come. <laughs> <laughs> After more than one year and one month of preparing, waiting and praying, now we're here. This is the day that we've all been waiting for. Why do I give it an 8.5 over 10 rating? Because I feel that the high frequencies, the troubles, are much more prominent than they need to be. But let me be clear, this is nothing that you cannot fix in post. If you ask me if I'll use this in weddings, yes, yes and yes, I'll use this in weddings every time for what it is right now, for what it can do right now, for the price point that it has right now, this is an instant buy. It's a no-brainer. Get one if you can. It says in the website, instamic.io, that there are only a few units left. So it's nice to be able to help somebody out who has a great idea for people like us, event videographers. Now take note, this is totally from a perspective of a wedding videographer. Imagine the possibilities of this little thing for musicians. The way that they can record music on the fly, on the go. The possibilities are endless. But I wouldn't know, I'm not, I'm not a musician. So there you go. I hope uh, you uh, learned something uh, from this uh, video and enjoyed as well. I think it is requisite to tell you to subscribe to my channel. Whatever questions you have, just put it down in the comments there and I'll try to answer as much as I can.